see ya. So thanks again, uh, Coach Jabbo, for, for joining us all the way to the Philippines. Yeah, uh, we have a lot of uh, aspiring kids from, from um, a range of our centres tuning in tonight, um, all levels. So uh, oh, we actually have uh, one of our staff members from Philippines as well who's tuned in um, to get a training session from you as well. He's in, he's in Pasay. Oh. That's uh, Christopher. Um, yeah, so we have a lot of uh, people here, um, all range of um, uh, experience from beginners all the way to international medalists. Um, before we, uh, and, and they're all quite excited to, to, um, to be training with you today. Uh, do you mind just um, giving them a little rundown of who you are and, and uh, what we're going to be doing today? Sure. Uh, hi, everyone. I'm uh, Coach Japoy, a uh, former uh, Philippine team member and, and former um, Philippine team coach from 2014 to 2019. So yeah, so I'm excited to teach everyone uh, some of my experiences. And you know, uh, Coach Terence is my uh, good friend. We go all the way back. So Coach Terence is also a uh, champion. And we're in the same weight also when we were fighting. <laughs> So yeah, a long time ago, definitely not the same weight now. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, just a bit of a, I think a rundown of the training. So we'll start with the warm up, some dynamic stretches, and then um, warm up high knees, and then we'll do footworks, and then some fakings that uh, I've learned before that I think will be helpful for setting up an opponent. So, and then some techniques also. All right. Sounds awesome, Coach. We'll leave it all to you. All right. So, let's start. Are we going to start now? Yeah. All right. Okay. So, first is the um, dynamic stretch. Okay. So, from here. So, can everybody see me or hear me? Can you hear me? Everybody, give me a thumbs up. All right, good. Okay, so let's count. One, up. Alternate legs. Hug your knees, up. Three, four, five, six, and then back. Here, up. One, two, three, Four, five, six, and then loops. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, arm stretch. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Okay, overhead. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Now, inchworm. Okay, down, crawl. Stretch, back stretch, then go up. Two. Three. Four. Next, we'll do lunges, lunge, then twist, okay, back, other leg, lunge and twist, back, lunge and twist, 
Launch and twist. Okay, this time launch and then put your elbows on the floor. Launch, and then elbows on the floor. One, then up. Change the leg, elbows on the floor. Twist. Last one, lunge to the floor. Okay, next, we'll do sitting down stretch. Butterfly stretch. Okay, bend down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One leg forward. Bend down, touch your toe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Twist back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The other side. Touch your toes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Twist back, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lift your chest, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, this time up the leg stretch. Okay, toe touching. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Bend. Put your toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Reach forward. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, and eight. Okay, massage. Okay, open some more. Overhead stretch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Center. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and eight. Okay, let's do side splits. Side splits. Go up. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then center. Elbows on the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly shake your legs, feet together. Stretch one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, so we're done with the stretching. We'll do warm ups. Is everybody up? Okay, for the warm ups, we'll do high knees ten times. Then we'll do um, two sets. Okay, two sets. Okay, so everybody ready? Go. Ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, bounce. Just bounce. And then second set, we'll try faster. Okay, faster pace. The high knees. Okay, ready? Second set, faster high knees. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, ready? Inhale, exhale. One, two. 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. This time we'll do double. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so eight times. Okay, we'll do two sets. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Second set. Faster pace. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Inhale, exhale. Breathe in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, this time, um, same leg, five times right, five times left. Okay? So ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, rest. Bounce. Second set, pass your pace. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, inhale, exhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, this time, we'll do sideways, like front leg kicking, front leg 45. So, five times, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, and then other side, five times, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, ready? Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Other leg, go. One, two, three, four, five. Bounce. Okay, second set. Faster pace. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Other side. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, inhale, exhale. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, last last set for the high knees. This time hanging. Okay, without going down. So from here, one, two, three, four, five. Then other side, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay, ready. First set. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Other side, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, inhale, exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, one more set. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, inhale, exhale. You can drink water if you want. Okay, so our next uh, drills will be footworks. Okay, so um, one step forward, uh, one slide forward, one slide back. So it, it's like this. Okay, so from here, five stands. Okay, one slide forward, then one slide back. Okay, so we'll do ten. We'll do it. Uh, Ten times. One forward, two back, three forward, three ah uh, four back. So ten times. Okay. So let's do it. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Inhale, exhale. Okay. We'll do one more set. Second set. Ready? Go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Change foot. Switch. Other side. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Inhale, exhale. Okay, one more time, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so next drill we'll do two slide forward 
and two slide back. Okay? So I'm going to do it sideways, okay, so you can see the movement. Okay, so two slide forward, one, two, then back two times, one, two, okay? And then while you're doing the, foot, the, the steppings, make sure your hands are always in front. Here, okay? Always in front. Ready to block the kick. Okay, ready? From here, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, rest. Okay, second set. Okay, ready? Second set. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, good. Okay, this time switch. Other side. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, ready, second set. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, inhale, exhale. You can drink water. If you want, I'll also drink water. Step forward, okay? Lead leg will step forward. Top, and then go back. Top, then go back. Clear? Did you get it? Okay. So let's start. We'll do 10 times, okay? So I want you guys to bounce. From the bounce position, one, two, 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 three, two, four, two, five, two, six, two, seven, two, eight, two, nine, two, two, two. Okay. Okay, just always remember to put your hand, uh, front hand here, and then extend when you fake. When you step, you extend your hand, okay, your front hand, okay? So when you step forward, you extend your front hand. Huh. Huh. Okay, like reaching for the opponent, okay? Okay, we'll do the other side. Okay, ready? From bounce. Okay, step, go, up, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up, nine, up, ten, up. Okay. Shake, shake, shake your arms and legs. Okay, so the explanation why the lead leg will step and not the back leg. So if you can notice, if you can notice my back leg stays in the position and then the lead leg will just step. Okay, in that way, in that way, you'll still have space to move back in case your opponent kicks, counter. All right? So like, um, you're like drawing an imaginary line, you know, imaginary line. That means, for example, here, this is my imaginary line. So I cannot stay there for a long time because the opponent will kick, okay? So you just like, um, uh, you know, you know, fishing like a bait, bait, you're baiting your opponent to kick so you can counter. Okay? It's just baiting. Bait. 
bait and then go back, bait and then go back, bait and when the opponent kicks, you can uh, move back and then counter kick. Okay? So let's do it one more time. Okay? This time, when you fake, when you step, step with reaching. So in case when the opponent kicks, you can block. Okay? Okay, let's do it one more time. Second set. Okay? Ready? Ten times. Do it ten times on your own. Okay? Feel the rhythm. Feel the bounce. And then do it on your own. Tuck. Ten times. Like, like doing a sparring. Okay? And then after ten times, switch. Other leg. Alright? Okay, ready? See Chuck? Go, start. So next, next faking, we'll do the this one. Stationary faking. Stationary. So from here, fighting stance, you'll do a wider uh, motion. Wide motion. Wide. Okay. So from normal position, normal fighting stance, you'll do a wider version. Fast. And then arms like drawing a letter U. U. Like lunging, so from a uh, normal fighting stance, um, stationary faking, like lunging with arms, okay? Like letter U. Like a wave, wave. So from here, bounce, bounce, bounce. Make sure your body's relaxed, upper body's relaxed, so that your opponent won't know if you're going to kick or you're going to fake. Okay, so when you move, um, your opponent will react. So now you'll know how to go in. Okay, so from here, okay, let's do 10 times. Okay, you can do it on a slow pace. Okay, and then on the second set, we'll do a fast pace. Okay, ready? From here, bounce, arms in front. Then when I say one, a wider motion, wider uh, leg, wider legs, then do a U motion, like a wave, wave, okay? One, uh, two, uh. Ready? Three, uh, four, uh, five, uh, six, uh, seven, uh, Did you get it? All right, so let's switch to the other side. Okay? Switch to the other side. All right, ready? So from here, bounce motion, bounce, and then just do a wider stance. Wider stance. Okay, here, wide, wide. Wide, 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 Okay, do it ten times. I'll watch. Uh, I'll check your stances. Okay, ready? Go on your own. Okay, good. Okay, good. Nice. Okay, just avoid stepping forward, okay? Just avoid stepping forward. It means that you're going inside the territory of the opponent. Okay, good. Okay, good. That's it. Okay, so make sure you're, you stay inside your imaginary line. Okay, so for example, this is my imaginary line. Do not cross. Do not cross. Don't step. Okay? So you have the space to move back. Just remember, 
Kids, just remember everything you do, you do it explosively. Fast, fast, everything. Okay? Fighting stance, bouncing, faking, you do it relaxed. Okay? Relax, relax, relax. And then when you move, when you kick, you do it fast. You do it quick, explosive. Okay? Good? Okay, so my sister is here already. Come here. <laughs> Please. My sister is a world junior bronze medalist and Asian championships bronze medalist. So we were teammates before. And then we also uh, went together to the Olympic qualifying. But unfortunately, we didn't get in. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So uh, I'll show you the drills, the step forward, lead leg step, and the stationary faking. Okay? So from here, yeah. So from here, lead leg step. Okay? It's like fishing. You're baiting your opponent to kick. Okay? Step, step, step. So you're checking, you're checking if he's gonna uh, do a counter kick, stationary kick, or attack. Okay? So, what do you think about? See, if your opponent kicks, when you step, if your opponent kick, kick, then you still have space to move back. And then when the opponent's leg goes down, then you can kick. Okay, again, move back on that. Again. Okay, clear? Okay, one more time, one more thing. Okay, when you step forward, step forward, and if your opponent doesn't react, okay, if he doesn't counter, he doesn't react, okay, you step forward, but come on down. And then kick right away. So when you're checking, lead leg step, step. If, you, if your opponent doesn't react, then maybe the third move, you can kick. Okay? One more time. So if you can notice, my step is not too fast because you're baiting. Like fishing, slowly, 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 slowly. And when the fish uh, eats the bait, you go fast. Right? Same in kicking. When you're stepping, don't go too fast. Don't go too fast. Because your opponent will react. Okay? So slow, slow. Like, like mind setting. Your opponent will think, oh, uh, his move is too slow. I can see his moves. And then when you kick, you explode. Tap. Your opponent is not ready. So you can hit your opponent. Is that clear? Okay, I'll do it one more time, okay? Relax, S slow, 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 fast. Okay, then the other one, the faking, faking, stationary, stationary fake. Good, 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 stop, Say, If your opponent doesn't react, then you kick. If your opponent reacts after the fake, you have space to move back and kick. Okay? So those who have partners, can you do it? Okay, one side will do the faking. One side will do the faking, fake and kick. The other one, it's either you can stationary counter or you just don't react at all. Can we do it? Okay, so those who are um, alone, you can just uh, imagine an uh, imaginary sparring partner. Okay, can you do it? Okay, let's go, let's go. Yeah. Do it 
on your own pace. Maybe you can do 10 times. Okay, and then change other side. So remember, I told you a while ago that you have to like draw an imaginary line. This is why. Okay, I'll explain it to you. So from here, this is my imaginary line, for example. Okay, this is my imaginary line, for example. Okay, this one. So I'm gonna beat my opponent. If I, if I invade her imaginary line, her territory, she's gonna kick. So that's my uh, mission for her to kick. So I can see if I can counter or see what kick she's gonna do. Okay? So from here, then go back. Because if you go inside too much, then kick, your opponent can hit you. Okay? So don't go all in like this. Okay? Only this one. And then if he doesn't react, if, he, uh, if she doesn't react, then two, kick. Okay? But if she keeps on moving back, two, move back. Then you just keep your distance. Move back. Move back. Okay? Okay. Okay, this time we'll do the stationary fake. The second fake, this one. So you're staying inside your territory. Okay, you're not going in her territory. Because if you go inside, she'll hit you. Okay, so from here. See, see the distance? It's still far. So in case he moves forward, move forward. You still have room to go back. Because if you're too forward, when you think when you're too forward, you don't have the space to go back. So from here, stationary, keep the sparring distance. Okay, keep the sparring distance. Think, keep. See? And then keep. Okay, again. Again, one more time. Same, same. If, you're, if you fake and then your opponent doesn't react, you can attack. Okay? What can we react? Is that clear? Clear? Okay, let's do that. Ready? Let's go, let's go. Let's do the second fake, stationary, open wide. All right, good job, good job, guys, good job. Okay, one more, one more, um, one more exercise. Okay, I want us to focus on out in, okay, or axe kick. Okay, so same lead leg step, lead leg step. Lead leg step, lead leg step, lead leg step. And then when your opponent goes in, because the space will be too uh, close, what, you get, what your opponent will do, is it, it's too close, when you step, it's too close, your opponent will go in, clinch, like that, right? When I step, go in. Step, go in, yeah. Step, pitch. Okay? So, when you step, step, and then simultaneously, when your opponent uh, is going towards you, tap, go, inside. Then throw an out-in kick. Throw an out-in kick. 
or axe kick. Okay? And if your opponent moves back when you step, out in, move back, then stay in the, this position. Okay? Keep your distance. Okay? Again. Okay? Then, step and then out in kick. Step, then out in kick. Okay? Can we try? Okay, others, uh, one side will do step, step, and then when your opponent, when your partner comes in, your partner goes in, throw out in kick. Okay? Okay, can you try it? So, other side, you just go inside. When, you're, when your partner steps in, you clinch. Okay, so that's the scenario. When your opponent likes to clinch, when you step, he's gonna clinch or he's gonna go inside, then you throw out in kick. Okay? Okay, everybody, let's try. Step, step, then out in. Okay, good. Try it 10 times. Okay, I'll teach you two more techniques and then maybe we'll do a cool down. And then question and answer. Okay, is that good? Okay, next technique. It's cancel. We call it cancel. Canceling the kick of the opponent. Okay, so if your opponent likes to cut or front leg, Okay, you cancel the kick. For example, your opponent likes to cut or wants to attack. And then, you know now uh, the rules now, when you go out of the mat, you get a gamjum, right? So we avoid that. We avoid moving back uh, too much. Say hi. Hi. Hey. <laughs> That's my son, <laughs> Jace. Show them how to kick. Ready? Kick, go. Hi, go. 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 Okay, go. go. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what we call cancel okay so if your opponent is too aggressive and you don't have uh, enough space to move back because you're gonna get a gam jump you cancel the kick okay so like this Cut. cancel okay you just lift up your front leg lift with hand with hand okay lift Okay, don't extend too much because if you extend your, your leg, it means you're kicking the leg. Okay, so it's also a gamjum. So just lift, okay, with this angle. Okay, cut, go, cut. Down, and then after you can kick. Again. So after the cancel, you can put down your leg and then kick. Okay, or you can do for more advanced uh, players, you can do hanging. Okay, don't put it down. Go hang, then down, kick. Okay, but this uh, this time we'll just do the cancel. So one side, one side will cut or any attack, front leg attack, then other side, cancel. Just cancel, okay? okay? So like this. 
I'm just gonna do cancel, she's gonna do cut or any front leg kick, okay? Okay, set clear, good. So make sure that your hand is in front, okay? So when the opponent kicks, it doesn't go in here. So it has to be like this. See, not like this, not like this, go, kick. Not like that, close, go, kick, close. That close. Okay? So this one will touch your knee. So the kick doesn't go in. Okay, good? Clear? Okay, let's do it. Like imaginary sparring, then do the cancel cancel. Okay, ready? Go. Okay, guys, sorry, sorry. Make sure you don't, you don't go in, okay? okay? Make sure you don't slide forward when you do the cancel, okay? Because when you go in, it means that you're catching the kick. Okay. Cancel. Uh, don't go in, okay? So stationary, let, let your opponent come inside, go. Go. Don't go forward. Go. See? Don't go forward. So stationary. Go. Okay, don't slide forward. Stationary. Okay? Go. Start. Go. Okay, you can also do the faking. Fake, fake, fake. Then cancel. Fake, fake, cancel. Okay, this time put kick after the cancel. After the cancel, kick. After the cancel, kick. Okay, go, start. After canceling the kick, counter. Okay, good. When you do the cancel, okay, after the cancel, now you can move forward when you kick. Jai. After the cancel, cancel, then you can move forward. Okay, go, kick, let's go. Okay, so last technique, okay, but before the last technique, I will just tell you the counter for the cancel, okay? so. If, um, if your opponent likes to cancel also, okay, what can you do if your opponent is doing the cancel? Can somebody answer? What kick can you do? Put, put, your, put your hand up if you want to answer and I'll unmute you. Or you just chat. You can put it in a chat or whatever or... So sometimes, um, you know, players tend not to think. So they just do same techniques all over. So how, how are you going to counter that? Perfect, Charlize. Yeah. Um, back leg roundhouse or inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, you can do that. Back leg roundhouse, um, hook kick, front leg. Okay, so like this. So when you're doing the roundhouse kick, make sure you lean back, okay? So for example, Jairus doing the cancel kick. Cancel, cancel, cancel. You're doing the cancel, and then you cannot go inside. Cancel, Cancel, kick, back leg. Okay, so there are many types of kicks that you can do. Maybe you can do also a hook kick, like a 
full moon kick to the body. So you can bake. So when, when the leg comes up, you do a hook kick. Okay? So it's also faking. Fake. Fake. When the opponent's uh, leg is up, then that's the time you throw a roundhouse kick or a hook kick. Okay? Okay, so last technique. So we call this impede. Okay? Or uh, intercept. So you're going to intercept the kick. Okay? Jai. So same. Same if she's doing a cancel kick or just doing a front leg kick. Okay? Front leg kick. Front leg. Any front leg. Okay? Any front leg. Any front leg. Then this time, you intercept a kick or you impede. Okay? Just put this up just like cancel. But this time, you're going to go in first before he lifts up. Before she lifts up his leg. Okay? So more. See, see how my knee is over her legs? So in that way, you're impeding his, uh, your opponent's kick. So your opponent cannot lift his leg. He cannot kick. Then, using your knees, you will push down your opponent's leg down and then kick. Okay? Okay. Slow mo, up, then up, 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 up. You're going to push with your knee down and then kick. Okay, again. Yep. Okay, so if your opponent keeps on kicking front leg like that. You go inside fast, impeding, go inside fast, and then put her legs down or your opponent's leg down, and then you can throw an out-in kick or a back leg round the house. Okay? Okay. So the motion should be fast going inside. Okay? So it doesn't matter if your opponent kicks or if your opponent uh, doesn't kick. Okay? The uh, important part here is that you go in fast, okay? So that you can impede your opponent's kick. That here? Or if you can explain better, Terence, or is that good? Yeah, so because um, we have a range of kids here, um, all, all this stuff that Coach Japoy is doing, um, some of you might not understand it, which is great, uh, which is fine, because I still want to expose you to this knowledge so that you get a head start in your sparring career. For the ones who do understand, uh, Coach Japoy is just saying to cancel their leg as you're going in. Um, but I like what he's saying about um, using the force of your knee to put it down for, for, for it to be open for you to follow up. So that's good. Okay, so let's try. Okay. Again, let's try. Let's go, guys. Let's try. So you can also do faking, slow, slow fake, slow, and then when you go inside, do it fast, fast, then kick. Okay. Fake, fast, kick. Again, fake, fake. Okay. Okay, let's go. I think this is uh, Korea's game play right now. That one. Yeah, it's actually um, it's actually cool that you're going through it because uh, with my Pro and Shadow team, um, we're just getting into. So we've been focusing on footwork quite a lot. Uh -huh. but, um, yeah, yeah, I like yeah, yeah. How you pulled it together using your footwork on, on 
different scenarios. But um, cancelling is like the next section that we're focusing on. So it's perfect. Yeah, good, good, good. So right now, really, um, the key is really footworks. Yeah. Not like before, like Iran style, you know, stable, just like that. When you go inside, they just kick, kick. Yeah. And then the key to um, counter that is footworks. Then go inside. And I think um, most of my fighters, not all, but most of mine are shorter than taller mm -hmm. opponents. And um, we try to emphasize a lot on uh, ring movement, being able yeah. to use angles and, 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 and use the ring. Um, but it's great that it's coming from a different person, a different national coach or a previous yeah. national coach, and the importance is still the same. So it's pretty good. Because you know, when you, uh, like, when you were competing before, yeah. I think right now, even if you just watch, I know you can deliver it to the uh, kids because you've experienced the ring, you know, yeah. when you're fighting. So, and not just that, like, um, we've fought. You, you and I have fought some of the best in the world, you know, so you know, or back then, and we know the level of intensity that they put on us when we, when, when we fight and how, how well you have to be conditioned in order to last the whole three rounds at that high level intensity. So it's very hard to kind of portray to the students when they haven't been in that, yeah, in, you know. under that pressure. But that's what experience does to you, right? Uh, yeah. You know the current uh, uh, world champion, finweight or flyweight? Korean champion? Yeah. I think this is his style. You know, um, impeding the attack, impeding, impeding. Then, if uh, the opponent doesn't react, he kicks. Impede and then go in, clinch and kick and out in. Yeah, Impede wow. and then when, when the opponent goes back, Backwards, he slide back, then impede, then he puts his his uh, leg up to do axe kick. Yeah. <laughs> so too many um, uh, kicks to be developed with this kind of style. And it's a, it's a, a lot of training to be able to yeah. keep that up for for, for consistently throughout the rounds. But this is just one step: the impede, impede. Okay, good. Okay, so when you're doing the, the exercise, you can like, um, what do you call this? Um, develop your own style of kicking. Like when you impede, after impeding, what kick do you want to kick or what kick can you do? Maybe a uh, back leg roundhouse, out in, maybe crescent kick, like that. So you really have to develop your own style also, okay? So you uh, do that by practicing, okay? So you keep on practicing, on practice, practice, practice. And then maybe you can develop uh, a kick that is suitable for that style, the impede. Okay. Good. All right. So that's the end of our drills. We'll just do cool down stretch and then we can do question and answer. Yeah. If you have questions. Yeah.